Hey everyone, it's Karen from Mayfly Life. I'm going to be making a furniture polish. This is going to be a wood polish that I can use for my uh, kitchen table. So I wanted to, to make a, a wood polish that I could use uh, for the table as well as for like my cutting boards, my wooden spoons and so forth. And it's great to bring moisture back into these, uh, these uh, instruments and so forth and, and furniture. Um, so I'm going to show you how this is going to be a small batch. As you can see, I've got my, uh, I've got a mason jar, just a little, little mason, mason jar. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to be adding, um, I've cut this recipe down quite a bit actually, and I'm going to be using 100 grams of olive oil. I'm going to measure out 50 grams actually. So this is a small batch. I mean, because like for me, I don't need a lot. So. There we go. Okay. And then I'm going to use 12 and a half grams of beeswax. Now this beeswax is uh, in chunks. So it's going to melt low and slow. And I need 12 and a half grams. There we go. And now that I've got that all measured up, I'm going to move it into a water bath. Okay, so now I'm putting it into a water bath with a couple of inches of water. Um, I've got it on a low, low heat on my, uh, on my element here. And what I need to do is just slowly melt the uh, beeswax in, uh, in the oil. And then I'm gonna be adding some uh, other ingredients. Now here, uh, some of the other ingredients, uh, you can add the vitamin E, which is what I'm doing because uh, I don't have uh, grapefruit extract. So I'm just, I am just have a few, uh, few capsules that you need uh, to put in. And that's what I'm doing here. It's just adding a few drops of vitamin E. So take about, I'd say, maybe four vitamin C or vitamin E capsules. Now I'll be adding essential oils for uh, a fragrance, but it also too, because it's an oil, it'll help uh, condition the wood. Uh, so uh, that'll be added later uh, because you don't want to add uh, uh, essential oils to anything super hot because you you could destroy the properties in the uh, in the essential oils. Now what I'm going to be using is uh, I want a woodsy scent um, for uh, for the uh, tabletop and makes sense. You got wood that you're conditioning and so forth and polishing and you want a woodsy scent. So I'm going to use cedar wood. Well, as you can see, it's uh, slowly melting down and uh, it'll take. It'll take at least you know 15 minutes or so for the uh, depending on the size of your uh, beeswax. Um, it'll take uh, you know about 15 minutes to uh, melt down. Okay. So now my beeswax is is all melted and mixed in. I've been stirring it uh, constantly so that it'll uh, distribute evenly. The beeswax will distribute evenly through the uh, olive oil. So now what I'm going to do is I'm going to add, uh, let this cool a bit and then add the uh, essential oils. So. Okay, so I'm back and this is uh, cooled down sufficiently enough that I can add the essential oils. And so I'm going to add a few drops of uh, grapeseed oil or grapefruit seed oil, um, grapefruit oil, and a little bit of cedar wood because I want that wood scent and the two of these go well so I'm adding more of the uh, the cedar wood I'm going to give that a little mix and 
and we're going to let it cool until it uh, becomes paste. Okay, so here's the final product. It's been a couple of hours now and you can see that it has uh, solidified uh, um, completely. So what, it, it, what it'll be is it's, it's like a soft like a soft paste as you can see and what you're going to do is you're going to just take just a rag you know like what you would normally use and you're going to just pull off some some wax like this and then you're just going to rub it in and you're going to see the difference and you're going to use it just like you would uh, a furniture polish like a conventional spray furniture polish but what you're going to see is how it shines, it protects the wood. So not only can you use it for your uh, your furniture but you can use it on wood chopping blocks protect and moisturize your chopping blocks. See, look at the difference. Wow. You can see it. Yep. Yeah. yeah, you can see it. What a difference. So go out and try it. Thanks for watching. Catch you in the next one.